Should I contemplate metaphysics? Metaphysics. I would like it if you actually meditated for a change. <laughs> you are a monk after all. Is contemplating different than meditating? Well, I use the words interchangeably. What matters is that you empty yourself, be filled with the infinite radiance of the void. All that good stuff. Am I empty right now? You would probably not have so many questions if you were empty right now. Is it bad to have questions? It is not bad to have questions. They are just ill-timed. What is it time for? Meditation. Where are we? It's hard to say to call a strange place like this. Have you been here before? Oh my gosh! Oh. <laughs> I keep coming here over and over and over. And over. Are we dead? Death is that most terrible misperception. Are we alive? Check and see. And how do I do that? It's like a bird that flies and flies and never lands anywhere. What would it find if it landed? That's that misperception called death. Where is it flying to? To meditate! Are we birds, Would be then? better than all of this conjecture. <sighs> Can conjecture be part of a meditation? At the very least, a bird knows its nature. Sit up straight. Do you know your nature? I suppose this is not a matter of knowing. What is it a matter of, then? These questions, these doubts are like small puddles that you flap about in desperately. Cannot one drown in puddles? You're drowning. How do I swim? Shh. Read your heart. The unflinching honesty and you know which direction you're heading. What if I'm stationary? Stationary. Stationary. Is this a stationary place? There is a place that neither comes nor goes, is neither moving nor still, is neither life nor death. It's not a place. I want to share that with you. What is a place that is not a place? 
Where is a place that is not a place?